Hey guys, it's Brendan. So I'm um, just heading to the office. I'm actually gonna start doing a weekly vlog, uh, kind of document behind the scenes of the show. We actually have a showgirl business, which is the Cheeky Showgirls. So just gonna start to show you guys behind the scenes, kind of document our week to week activities. Yeah, so stay tuned. We got some new showgirls starting up today. Uh, they just finished the training. We're just about to set them up, get their own costumes. Uh, it's got some other costumes here, which are half made. I just got to drop off to the office. Yeah, if you believe it or not, uh, this small town kid from Australia actually makes these costumes. I don't know how, I don't know why, I don't know how I got into it, but I do. So if you don't know who Christian is, uh, this is the man behind the camera. This guy makes the show happen. Uh, the man pretty much mans the camera, helps with logistics, makes the show happen. I'm just the face of the company. <laughs> so he's pretty important. Hi, so. everybody. <laughs> We're in the office. We've got two new girls. They just finished their four days of training. And say hey. Hi. And over here. So there, two of our new cheeky showgirls, um, done four days of training. So if you're interested, hit us up. And there's some um, mesh you see behind us. It's actually our cheeky oh, yeah. truth, a cheeky showgirls flow chart, which we spent probably two, two and a half hours of gibberish. Gibberish. <laughs> and now uh, Christian needs to um, refine that. Yeah. Um, he should have started by now. I did. No, he did. I did. It looks good so far. <laughs> it's just about a thousand steps. So that's literally the process from start to finish for the showgirl and. Yeah, it's hectic. It's chaos right now. So guys, this is where the old magic's been happening as far as the costume making. Um, here's some finished costumes. Uh, you wouldn't believe how long these things take. They're not super complicated to make, but they do take a long time. Um, so now I've got two more headpieces to make. So let's get to it. So now we're later, we're finished. Nice and pretty. Um, Attach it to the back of the headpiece and we're good. See you in the morning. All right, so just heading to the mall, got some new Cheeky Truth t-shirts to pick up for the show. Our team's constantly growing, so we're constantly trying to keep enough shirts. Uh, it's going to pick up some new ones. And good news, we actually will be selling the Cheeky brands and Cheeky clothing, tops, uh, booty shorts, tights, like gym tights, very soon. It's just we're so busy with the showgirls and the show right now, so it's on the to-do list. I just want to hold you. I just want to look into your eyes and tell you that I want you. So Guys, just a side note, if you're interested in joining like the Cheeky team, uh, whether you're actually in Vegas or you're overseas, we're looking for new hosts, um, you could actually run the show from Australia or a different part of the world under the Cheeky name. Also, anyone in Vegas wants to be part of the team, just hit us up. Alright, so we got the new shirts, let's check them out. So it's white this time, let me show you the black. And then the back. YouTube logo on the butt. So we're gonna look like that this time. So you haven't seen the show, check it out. Would you date someone shorter? No. No? Yes. Oh really? Mm -hmm. Good girl. Tattoos, guys have tattoos, yes or no? Yes. Why? Is that because you're into it? Not because of that. Like, there has to be some sort of like story behind it. I think as long as, if you have tattoos, it's a plus. All right guys, morning. Here with Nelly, one of our showgirls. We're about to do a video shoot. We're at, uh, out in the desert. We're gonna do, try to do something kind of sexy. Use the showgirl costumes. It's always good for extra media. It's good for the girls. Let's get to it. All right, so I'm just gonna attempt to show you guys how I actually film this. Generally, I'll set up a shot and I'll try to get different angles, nice and close. That's it, and just constantly move around. Okay, that's it. That's perfect, that's amazing. Slide down. Yeah, so cover your eyes as I slide down, slide down over the flaky bottoms. Bring it right up. Yeah, now come down. Yeah, a little bit faster. Yeah. Sailors passing on the street, are you ready for peace? Mm -hmm. Ships are filling up fast, are you ready?
All right, guys, so that's kind of how we do it. Pretty girl, pretty location. Uh, if you want to shoot, hit me up. If you want to join the team, hit me up. Yeah, see you next time. Bye. Snap. Oh, snap. All right, guys, so we're here. We're at, uh, it's Friday. We're going to First Friday, which is like a local event, which is, how to explain it? It's like a local event for artists and creatives of all kinds. It's like food, a bunch of local people, music, art. So it's a good time. So we're here with the Cheeky team. We've got Bree, got Adrian back here. Woo! Jacob, Christian. What up? This is the whole team. It goes together to get the cheeky drift done. All right, guys. So this is first Friday. It's kind of like stalls and music, lots of people. It's definitely like a like a local crowd, isn't it? Oh yeah. So generally, like we shoot Fremont Street, uh, Fremont Street East, Las Vegas Strip. Oh yeah. Uh, but every month we've been coming here lately just to mix it up. Yeah, and get to know some locals. Yeah. It's so always been cool, cool people from all around the world, but never locals. As, as Brie will tell you, the hardest thing about this show is, um, what is it? Um, it's finding people who actually answer questions. It's stopping someone, it's walking up to a stranger in the middle of the street, stopping them. And not getting rejected. And then, then convincing them to answer cheeky questions. Yeah. That's the hardest thing. So what we generally do, we set up two cameras, uh, two different angles, that way we get two different backgrounds. We try to get a bunch of people, get some answers, and then we swap up backgrounds, swap angles, try to make it look like we're moving around more than we really are. Yep. Yep. <laughs> This was a cheeky showgirl. It was a cheeky showgirl. And now she's going to be a little apprentice um, host. Yeah. Hopefully. A cheeky host. Hopefully she's going to be like a backup to Brie. She's going to help Brie out and going to help her with some pranks. Yeah. Oh, my favorite thing to do. Yeah. Prank so people. I actually met her by interviewing you. When I was How many a showgirl. Times, yeah. How many times have I interviewed you? Three times. Two. Three. But she's been a really good spot and she's allowed me to ask her some cheeky questions. Yep. <laughs> so this is Brie on the hunt to get people. Yes, let's do it. Yes, let's do it. Come on. <laughs> do it, guys. Do it. Over here, though. We're just vlogging. I guess we're not some. There's a go over there. So, Bree hunts them down and then we drag them over to the mics. What's the number one mistake women make in bed? Saying daddy. Easy. <laughs> not a fan of it. Not at all. Why? Because I, until I was like 13, I still called my dad daddy. Not a fan. Does it creep you out? A little bit. All right, guys, so we just got one more interview to go. Uh, it's freaking hot, man. Like, it's, it's really hot. It's making it very hot. Everyone's struggling. Uh, Breach just got a last interview over here. What do you think, Jacob? First time of shooting, what do you think? Uh, yeah, it went pretty well. Uh, bit of fun, it's pretty yeah, funny. People are pretty honest with their, uh, with their questions. Or yeah, their answers. did a good job. What do you think, Christian? Good job, Jacob. You did an awesome job. Good night of filming, good yeah. answers. We won't, we won't tell you the questions. You'll have to tune in, subscribe. Yeah, subscribe, definitely. Subscribe, and then you'll see what's coming up. See you guys.